we have these little Duncan holes. Yeah. Dude. Can I just, can I calmly can say. Can I say something calmly? Can I just set it up? Go ahead. Okay. Gary walked out in the hall. He said to Ronnie, oh, wow. How did these Duncan holes get here? Who mm-hmm. do I owe this to? And Ronnie started yelling at Gary. I said, Ronnie, who put these out? He goes, how the fuck do I know? So Jason but he's goes, supposed to. He's secured. Jason goes, no, isn't they it your... were here when we walked in Hold already. He said, J- oh. Jason said, isn't it your job to know so that we don't eat poison food? And then Ronnie went from zero to 60. So said, my fucking job. Who the fuck are you? It's a quarter <laughs> after eight. Okay. <laughs> yeah. They're all stuffing their faces with these donuts already. Obviously. Then, then nobody dropped At a quarter dead. after eight, they're asking me who brought the donuts. I was just curious. They, were, dude, they were here at 530. Do you know, obviously. Do you know who put them? Yeah. In? Who? Steve Griffin. But he just found that out. I just found out. After we asked him, he launched an investigation. He was yelling at one of our other writers. He had everybody out there. Why are you so angry? People just want to know that you know. (laughs) They're afraid of being poisoned in this atmosphere. Listen, (laughs) they're not being poisoned. How do you know? Because I ate one at 6 o'clock and I'm not dead. But if you died, then we wouldn't know who... Are you the royal taster? I say this. You're head of security, right? Why don't you... I know when food comes in here during the show, we never fucking accept it unless we know who it is. Otherwise, it goes in the can. But why do you blow there's up on couple, Gary There's asks, a couple who, of guys that always bring no, stuff in early Jason, in the morning when they come to work, so when Jason and asked, they put it out on the got, counter. He got very upset when Jason asked. Jason goes, Jason just asked. Because he said, he, he doesn't stuffed know. his face with a whole bunch of But he was curious already. to know, shouldn't you know? That he was asking a He wasn't a being confrontational. Question. Were you being confrontational? Not at all. I, 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 first of all, I would like to thank whoever brought them in. Right. So that was number one. So I assume... By the way, the guy's name is... Steve Griffith, yeah, Griffith. not Griffin. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> You're not important. All right. Um, Who his cares? name is Steve, as far as I'm concerned. And by the okay. way, should you be eating donut holes with your size? Well, that's a whole second conversation. Okay. All right. But what but was this conversation? This conversation was, A, I'd like to thank the person, and B, I was surprised that Ronnie had no idea how a bunch of food ended up on our ledge. Because right. I know anytime someone sends food over, the first person you contact is Ronnie. Right. And you say, <laughs> Ronnie, be when they this... send it over. Yes. So, so the... he was just asking you. But but it is yeah just and it literally and I said to you I go when you started yelling at me I go we're not on the air I'm not doing a bit I just want to know who brought the donuts no the way you ask Jason it's always a bit oh, <laughs> but in is the meantime the there seems to be a hole in the security so if you get the food in here no before you show up security. it could be anything there's no hole in the well, security well maybe maybe because there's a security person here before I get here I, I don't want to spend the whole morning on this but I see there's a lot of tension out there there's everybody no calm tension. the fuck there's down there's no tension. It's is Seems anybody like, dead? Go just, back to work. No, they just want to make the fucking tension. Yeah. <laughs> they want well, to make the fucking tension. Evidently, you yelled at several other staffers. No, I staffers. yelled at fucking goddamn Jason. No, but they say you yelled at other staffers about the donut holes. Yeah, because they're playing games now after J- after the Jason thing. They're all working over and they're going, who brought the donuts? Who brought the donuts? Who brought the donuts? And then what happens? Do you know who brought the donuts? You have to know who brings food in here. Oh, this, now I'm out now. All right, what do you want? Oh, don't worry, you want to get rid of me, you bring him in? Who, Chris Wilding? Oh, Why? God. You, you don't like Chris? <laughs> no, he loves to fucking stir shit, too. Did you I, stir? Are you stirring him up? I came back from the bathroom. I didn't know anything that had gone on. He starts yelling at me. I didn't Did yell you anything fucking at bring you. these? Are these your donuts? <laughs> yeah, I'm, doing, I'm trying to find out who brought He's them. being a detective. Yeah, I mean, that's that's from an investigation. Yeah. It was Bedlam. It was Bedlam. Bedlam. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. You it was walk Bedlam. In, you walk oh. into your compound and it's just yelling and screaming. Screaming. So come investigate. Who yeah. these donuts? Screaming. He goes, Let's... you know who brought him? Mr. Duncan. That's who. Fuck yeah. off. Yeah. Yeah. He's doing comedy. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Right. Now I'm doing comedy. What am I, Jay Edgar Donut? Do a thorough investigation. All right. Don't carry on with him. Leave me alone. Right. Yeah. Leave, leave him everyone alone. alone. A young man. Yeah. You're an asshole. He's doing the Ronnie <laughs> show for nobody. All right. <laughs> All right. Go out. Everyone go out and work now. I'm like the Columbo of donuts. <laughs>